Yo, what is up, YouTube? CJ Sauce here, and we are back talking about the 50 out of 50 Patriots theme team. The lineup is built, the lineup has been played, tested, ability set. We are ready to roll. We are going to go through today in this video the lineup. We're going to talk about who is where, talk about some of the abilities, talk about a couple of upgrades. With that, bro, let's get the heck into it. All right, guys, so we are here. This is what the roster looks like. We'll start out here showing you. We are currently at 51 out of 50 paths. I have like four or five non-Patriots players in the active lineup that actually don't see the field. So I'll be able to get rid of those and make some upgrades around the team somewhere, uh, depending on where I start to find my weaknesses at. We're at 45 go deep, 45 lockdown, and 20 sprinter. So a lot of these players are actually looking really good. We will start on the line. Isaiah Wynn, he does have edge protector. Joe Tooney, Jason Kelsey, David Andrews. You've got Jari Evans, Shaq Mason, Jonathan Ogden with edge protector. Trent Brown, Jermichael Finley with tight end apprentice. Gronk fully powered up. You've got Scary Terry with deep out elite. Uh, Mike Allstott, Danny Vitale. You've got Josh Allen with set feet lead and gunslinger. Tom Brady, Corey Dillon, Raheem Moster, Julian Edelman with route tech and Brandon Cooks. A couple of the people I want to kind of highlight here are Corey Dillon. I had Mostert in here because I wanted the speed, thinking that Corey Dillon wasn't going to be that good. But if you look at Corey Dillon, he is a monster, and he plays even better than his stats. Look, 93 speed, 94 acceleration, 92 carrying. He's got 90 change of direction. And then you go down to his offensive ball carrier, things you're going to see, you know, 81 spin, 87 juke. That's not bad for what you would think historically as a power back. And then he also comes in with, uh, 91 break tackle. Um, he looks like a really, really good running back, and he plays even better. So Mostert, actually, I don't need anymore. I'm going to find a really good receiving back to sort of replace, play the back up there instead and let Corey Dillon get the majority of the carries. The other guy is Julian Edelman. So I thought I would need more receiver upgrades, but Julian Edelman is out of his mind. 91 speed on him, 92 catching. He's got 90 or 91 short, 89 mid, and 85 deep. So with the 91 speed and route technician, he actually plays super 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 good so really happy with that the offense is looking good next upgrade on offense i need to get josh allen's team of the week card so i will be doing the uh i'll be doing the get a player method this week trying to get enough enough money to power up josh allen and get that team of the week set done on defense this is where it gets really good and really fun you've got deron Harmon deep in zone ko a dalius thomas junior sale mid zone ko sam mills john bostick Chandler Jones, Kyle Van Noy, Rodney Harrison without my way, Asante Samuel, mid zone KO and deep out zone KO, Hicks, Glover, Seymour, Stefan Gilmore, and Devin McCourty with deep out zone KO and mid zone KO. And then you've got Jair Alexander here in the backup. A couple of guys I'm going to highlight here. I'm going to show you Deron Harmon. He is with Patriots, Kems, and Sprinter. Uh, 92 speed, 99 zone, 97 play rack. So that combined with deep in zone KO. At the safety spot, he is un, unreal. I mean, absolutely unreal. And then you're going to look at somebody like Devin McCourty, who is that cornerback for me. Check these stats out on Devin McCourty. These are wild. Devin McCourty comes in here for me with 95 speed, 99 play rec, 99 zone, and 94 man coverage. He is unbelievable at cornerback. Unbelievable at cornerback. He's so good, especially with mid zone and deep out zone KO. You put him in any type of zone, he's I mean, unbelievable, absolutely unbelievable. And then the other thing, one thing that you guys are going to see, I'm going to talk about it a lot on my stream. Please check me out at Twitch, twitch.tv slash CJ sauce and watch me user Rodney Harrison. So 93 speed, 95 zone, 91 hit power on him. He's got 90 agility and he has the ability out my way, which basically he, he instant sheds dominant impact block wins versus receivers, halfback and tight ends. So as long as it's not a lineman, you just get this crazy sh sh like shrug off animation where he just basically shrugs off any blocker. You run right through and you can gap shoot like crazy with him. That ability is so good. And then you combine that with the zone KOs that I have all over the field between mid zone on junior, mid or deep in zone, uh, mid zone, deep out, mid zone and deep out. And this team plays lights out. And then you look over at the defense. Uh, where I've got, like I said, Jair Alexander I had because of his speed previously, but he doesn't see the field anymore. Special teams, the Patriots kicker and punter. Specialists, I do have Derwin and Isaiah Simmons here, but they don't see the field either. They used to when I played 3-3-5, but I don't need them because of how well my linebackers play. Um, so we've got about five roster spots we can start to make upgrades. So when I start to notice some of these Pats players not holding their own, we'll start to just fill in the best players in the game and make this team really, really good. 
the next upgrades on defense where you're going to get james harrison here because right now on on the line i'm playing uh john bostick chandler jones richard seymour Leroy glover akeem hicks and then sam mills so i'm going to replace akeem hicks with uh james harrison and i'll play james harrison the way that i play chandler jones and that will be really really good um so the next upgrade we are going to make yeah will be james harrison on offense it will be finishing josh allen and then after that we just today or yesterday got chad ochocinco so chad ochocinco's new card will be placing terry mclaurin and i'm super super excited about that so that's going to be the next three things we try to do is we're going to try to get uh josh allen finished then we're going to get james harrison then we're going to add uh chad ochocinco and with that we'll be able to add about six more players so you're going to start to see some non-pats players start to sprinkle their way into this team um hidden in different places and i'm really excited for that but that is your team that's a very good roster very very good stats as you saw on some of those players make sure you guys are playing a theme team and then like i said go ahead and check me out on twitch where you'll actually be able to check out some of the gameplay and we can talk about live who i'm playing how i'm playing them where i'm playing them and that kind of thing um but uh, with that, we're going to call it a video. Make sure you guys subscribe to the channel, like the video, and comment down below with any questions or drop by the Twitch channel. I will catch you guys next time.